when Paul received his mission from Jesus, he didn't immediately consult with flesh and blood. What did he do? Nor did I go up to Jerusalem to those who were apostles before me, but I went away to where? Arabia, which is very near Damascus, and returned once more to Damascus. Then, how many years? Three years later, I went up to Jerusalem to become acquainted with Cephas, who was Peter, and stayed with him 15 days. So how many years was the many days? Three years. And when many days had elapsed, the Jews plotted together to do away with him. Isn't it amazing that Saul took time to get to know his new master? I wonder. I don't think many of us can take three years to spend time getting to know God. But can we take 15 minutes a day? Can you take 30 minutes a day to continue to get to know who your master is? The reason I believe Saul was so effective also, his intimacy with God was something else. And if you and I don't spend time getting to know the God of the Bible, we may be in danger of making our own version of God. Get to know the God of the Bible. Spend time with Him. He is alive. Jesus is risen. That's what turned Paul's world around. That Jesus is really alive. And He speaks to you. He speaks to me through his word. Will we listen? Will we take time? Is your relationship with God transformed? Have you experienced his transformation?